Yeah. It's going to be hell man the 15. <clears throat> I'm just talking to me. You even read that? Is it backwards? <clears throat> anyway, Hillman 15. Now, beloved brethren. <clears throat> I declare unto you that, except ye shall repent, your houses shall be left desolate unto you. Yeah, except ye repent, your women shall have a great cause to mourn when they attempt to give suck. Ye shall attempt to flee, and there will be no place for refuge. Yeah, woe unto them that are with child, they are heavy and they cannot flee. They shall be trodden down and left to perish. Yea, woe to the people who are called the people of Nephi. Except they, sh except they shall repent when they see the signs and wonders <clears throat> which shall be shown unto them. Behold, uh, they have been a chosen people of the Lord. Yea, the people of Nephi hath he loved. He has also chastened. Yeah, in the days of their iniquities, he chastened them because he loved them. But behold, brethren, he hated the Lamanites because their deeds have been continually evil. Because of their iniquity, of the tradition of their fathers. But behold, salvation has come unto them through the preaching of the Nephites. And for this intent has the Lord prolonged their days. And I wish that you should behold that the more part of them are in the path of their duty. They do walk circumspectly before the Lord. Circumspectly before God. They observe to keep the commandments, statutes, and judgments per the law of Moses. <clears throat> yeah, I say unto you, that the more part of the people are doing this, they are striving with unwearied diligence that they may bring the rest of their brethren to the knowledge of the truth. Many who do add to their numbers daily. Behold, you know, you witnessed it, many of them are brought to the knowledge of the truth. And to know of the wicked, abominable tradition of their fathers. And are led to believe the Holy Scriptures. And the prophecies of the Holy Prophets, which are written, which leadeth them to faith on the Lord and unto repentance. Faith plus repentance bringeth a change of heart. <clears throat> you know you're firm and steadfast in the faith. Faith in the thing where they have been made free. Ye know also that they have buried their weapons of war, <clears throat> and they fear to take them up, lest by any means they should sin. Ye can see that they fear to sin, for behold, they suffer themselves that they be trodden down and slain by their enemies, and will not... <clears throat> Uh, <clears throat> will not lift their swords against them because of their faith in Christ. Now, because of their steadfastness in the thing that they believe, because of their firmness, when they are once enlightened, the Lord shall bless them and prolong their days, notwithstanding their iniquity, Yet even if they dwindle in unbelief, the Lord shall prolong their days until the time comes when, uh, which was spoken about by our fathers and the prophet Zenos and many other prophets concerning the restoration of our brethren, the Lamanites.
and bring the Lamanites again to the knowledge of the truth. Yeah, I say to you that in the latter times, the promises of our Lord have been extended to our brethren, the Lamanites. Many afflictions which they shall have, they shall be driven to and fro upon the face of the earth, hunted, smitten, scattered. No place for refuge. The Lord shall be merciful to them, according to the prophecy that they shall be brought to the knowledge of their Redeemer, who is the great and true shepherd, and be numbered among his sheep. Therefore, it shall be better for them than for you, except you repent. Behold, had the mighty works been shown unto them, which have been shown unto you, yeah, unto them who have dwindled in unbelief because of the tradition of their fathers. You can see that they would never have again dwindled in unbelief. Therefore, saith the Lord, I will not utterly destroy them, but I will cause that in the day of my wisdom they shall return again to me, saith the Lord. Now, behold, concerning the people of the Nephites, if they will not repent and observe to do my will, I will utterly destroy them, saith the Lord, because of their unbelief, notwithstanding the many, many mighty works I have done. Surely, as the Lord liveth, shall these things be, saith the Lord. <clears throat> 